We've only been apart for three days in our entire lives and um, I headed to New York City for two weeks and, and I was in LA. Life is about the journey, not the destination. That's kind of cliche, but that's what we're <laughs> gonna go with. I'm Poonam. I'm Priyanka. And this is our journey to one million. Thank you guys for 300k. It's an honor to be followed by 300k people, so thank you. We're Especially because we haven't posted in months. Yeah, it's been like four months since we posted. And, and um, um, yeah, it's been a minute, but it's mainly because we needed a break from uploading and we needed a break <laughs> from our twinliness. Yeah. yeah, as much as we love being twins, I think we're now at the point where we're arguing a lot and we want to fix our dynamic issues with each other, so we think this is a great thing to do. Like, I remember vividly that Priyanka said I would not sit next to her. Because, I, and I thought that was rude, but she didn't sit next to me. Like, when, when, when I noticed that, I noticed myself getting angry at her for saying the same things again and again. She's like getting mad at me for existing, basically. Yeah. <laughs> she's always like nagging me, and she's like, oh, like, you know, you should really go to sleep, or like, I do nag a lot. I got like so mad that I made her cry. Listen, you know what, I really think it'd be great if you found a job you know, in another city, <laughs> you know, where, where you can yeah. do what you do and yeah. physically remove yourself and start start a life. One a foundation, one everything, and now we had to buy two of everything. It's just like less costly that way. Why would we buy two of everything? <sighs> Bye, Bri. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> So we've only been apart for three days in our entire lives and um, I headed to New York City for two weeks and, and I was in LA. So let's see what we did. Things we can undo. You just in the pen, I can find you. Six one on the money, nine two. You just said a word and I run through. Two texts, no reply. That's when I knew, I knew, I knew. Yeah, I, I knew. Me, me, me at the London. Me, me, me at the London. Me, me, me at the London. Me, me, me at the I literally just sat in my hotel room for like two weeks straight and I call literally, it. yeah, I, I <laughs> realize I'm kind of like a loner. So I just FaceTimed her and she's literally not doing anything. She's just like on her bed, going <laughs> to Walmart. How do you know? Oh, what other plans do you have? I have plenty of plans. Like what? I'm social, but I don't make the effort of going anywhere. So like Priyanka's always the instigator, so she'll like take mm -hmm. me to the parties. Mm -hmm. Like she'll, mm -hmm. she's the one who will contact our friends. Like once I'm there, I'm extremely social. What I learned was that I do like my own company and that's important. For me personally, I felt weird. All the things that we did together, I tried to do by myself. Like, you know, I was filming content by myself. I was taking photos by myself. I was just doing things that I usually do, meeting people up by myself. And it was fun, but it's like a ton more fun when you're around. It's really not as much fun without my 20. I think the other thing I kind of learned was that I just don't know how to have fun by myself. Like, oh, I already knew that. <laughs> okay, I discovered that I'm actually bad at it. I'm bad at having fun. See, she 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 noticed my presence. I valued <laughs> oh, my presence. Okay. <laughs> when I was God. <laughs> Those were my life realizations, being alone for two weeks. I will say it's more fun when your twin's around. Yeah, I, I took no pictures, I took no content, like no video content. You were like hanging out in your hotel person. room watching Netflix. Yeah. How is that hanging out with yourself? I don't know, maybe I like to watch Netflix. Why you gotta hate? <laughs> I was like determined to enjoy my own company. I noticed myself like basically when I would upload pictures sometimes, it was for the validation of other people to like my photo rather than me just liking my own photos. Yeah. I, I think like I can tell she likes herself better. Oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Freaky. So we didn't really realize this before, but kind of finding your individuality, who you are separate from being a twin, 
is really important to keeping your twinship healthy. Yeah. So even posting this photo, I wrote a caption yesterday and Poonam hated it and she just wrote one right now while we were waiting and I hate her caption. So now we're gonna have to figure out whose caption we're using. My caption is definitely better. We can't even decide on a caption for this and we have to post this right now. There's a lot of unhealthy like twin relationships and dynamics that form and we only realize that after going to Dr. Joan Friedman. There's so many dynamics between twins that just don't end up working out into adulthood that we didn't realize we needed to work on. If you're super strong individually and then you come together as like a twin duo, you're so much more powerful. So that begs the question, who are we outside of being twins? So um, I got really into like singing and so I took like vocal lessons. She's always wanted to sing. I even took like rap lessons. Like I, <laughs> I found an instructor who taught people how to rap and I just took rap. That's pretty adventurous of you, I'm not gonna lie. It was pretty cool. I actually really liked it and I'm gonna continue with it because it makes me happy. I feel like the things I did were the things that we do anyways. Maybe because I'm always following what you want to do. Okay, because I'm the only one who makes the plans. I, I think it's a very voluntary follow. Maybe. <laughs> you just like shot yourself in the foot. I'm not confirming nor denying. <laughs> Shut up. Okay. <laughs> so we spent the two weeks doing lots of different things, but I feel like mostly it was just me eating by myself. True, eating by yourself is so annoying. Yep. Not doing that shit again. <laughs> <laughs> it's so depressing. Thank you guys for 300k. Um, I can't believe we're at 300k subs. And we haven't even posted in four months. Right now is kind of like the low point in our journey to 1 million. Like, just been kind of demotivated. Uninspired for me personally. I feel Uninspired like and demotivated. Yeah, we can't be consistent. We haven't found something that we love making on a weekly basis. Certain types of content is so time intensive. It just like gets a lot and you're just stressed out trying to do it every week. So we need to find like something on the weekly that we're just like really happy and really not stressed about making. These videos mean a lot to us, even if they do only get 15K views, it doesn't matter. Like 10 millions or 15K, like it doesn't matter. If you enjoy doing something on the weekly, that's what you should keep doing. It took us about six months to get to 300K after we hit 200K. And um, I'm not gonna lie, we thought that we would probably do that faster. I think along the way, we kind of, you know, needed that break and that's why we stopped uploading. Uh, we were disagreeing with each other. Yeah. Quote that I read, most things will work if you just unplug it and then plug it back in like a few minutes later. That works for your life as well. Yeah, I completely agree with that statement. Yeah, thank you guys for being here and we really appreciate all y'all. Yeah. And um, we're gonna try all these different types of videos. We're gonna try like more comedy sketches, more dances, we're gonna try like fashion haul videos. We're gonna try like fitness videos, skincare, lifestyle. Just comment on below what you guys want to see, actually, and um, we'll try it out. Thanks, Thanks guys. guys.